Hi everyone and welcome back on Pose Bricks Lab. This video opens a new series dedicated to the FFX7 Core Fighter Mock I designed in 2018 using LEGO Digital Designer. I hope you enjoy! Remember to subscribe to the channel and to leave like to give your support. It is very important for the channel to grow and is free. Let's start from the 3D model you see here, making a panoramic of the model and its functions. This is actually a prototype, meaning this is just the first scratch and still it has never been reviewed. I'm just proceeding with the first review of the prototype while building it for the first time, so I'm very excited and inquisitive about the changes I'll have to make to solve some issues I will take you about later on. These are the jet engine intakes. The core fighter has six jet rocket engines. Take a look at the rear. It really looks not bad. These are the missile launchers. Some old connectors are used here. Those will be difficult to change with the new ones. We need to change orientation to the model in order to check the landing gears. The retracting gears are stuck in open position by their own cover panels. With the core fighter and the flight asset, it's possible to perform the transformation. To retract the fighter's nose in the designer, it's necessary to use that yellow brick trick. The fighter turns into the mobile sweet skull in just 8 moves. To proceed with the building work, I divided the model into its constituent parts, so I can build them one by one and then assemble all them together. For example, this is the core left hull. And this is the left wing. As you can see, in this design I use some old parts that are no longer available, but I have these parts in stocks for sure, among my old vintage parts. Although I have those parts in stock, I'll change this intake detail with a different solution, using current available parts. Now let's take another look to the model. That is definitely a core fighter. It looks as it is maneuvering, flying or something. Let me check this old editor for some background. 
Wow, the space looks so good. Let's see the others. The desert is definitely pertinent with the story. This is funny, it looks like flying in DC as Caucasus map, if you know what I'm talking about. It looks so nice in the middle of the valley. The core fighter at the Mac loop, very nice. Oh, the eagle's effect too. At least here, nobody is shooting at you. Um, yes. Well, I didn't remember about this effect when I shoot this video and uh, I activated by chance. So I was a bit scared and surprised to see the model exploding. And then I got a taste for it. Let's not digress and go back to our 3D model. Let's take a closer look to the landing gear functions. And now let's look the transformations from different angles. Now this is the actual state of art. The inner part of the core is still missing but that's more than enough to give you an idea. This concludes this introduction video. In the next videos, we're gonna follow the building and developing of this LEGO version of the FFX7 Core Fighter. Remember to subscribe and leave a like to support the channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time on Paul's Bricks Lab. Carlo, ma che stai registrando? Ah. Lascia vedere. Eh, eh, fai entrare. Sì, fermo un attimo.